one of the things I've noticed out here is these bass are fattening up really nice. That typically happens out here about this time of the summer. And uh, they're spitting out all kinds of bait fish. I mean, they're, he's not very long, but look how, how fat he is. He's got a, his belly is, you know, growing up. Just needs to get a little longer, but nice, healthy spotted bass. I threw a bunch of things at him this morning, but uh, couldn't get bit on anything. So I decided to go with a small swim bait. Just this little two and a half inch swim bait. Without all the, without wind, this may be uh, the way I'm going to have to fish for a while today. go another spotty just bouncing this swim bait off the bottom it's kind of hopping it that seems to trigger a lot of strikes out here come here buddy uh, definitely active just hop this thing along make it look like something's trying to get away from them they can't stand it a whole bunch of them on the graph here. They're right on the bottom down there mixed in with some bait. And I think hopping this thing, all that bait down there makes a little bit of noise. Kind of a way to maybe get their attention. They're jumping around, but I can't seem to get them to get anything on the surface. I don't really like it when it's like this. It's real calm out here right now. I was hoping for some morning wind and uh, had a number of things I've got tied on. I got two different chatterbaits tied on. I got a crank bait. I got a jerk bait. I even got a frog tied on. But uh, right now, as calm as it is, this is about the only thing I can do to get them is slow it way down, which is sometimes hard to do. And uh, probably have to throw some drop shots here in a little while. But this has been working pretty good right here. I'll just keep doing this. Hopefully I'll get some more. Yeah, I don't know what it is that's uh, just driving them nuts with this, but it's just that hopping that bait around. They just can't seem to resist it. All I gotta do is get it in front of them. That one there, he bit it, shoot, he bit it immediately. I think it was the second hop. In fact, he bit it so fast, they didn't even know I had him. I went and pulled my, my rod up and I felt some weight. You know, he, the hook's already set in him. Little chunky guy. It's Dalton, everybody. I, uh, my wife and I did a video. Oh, it was a couple of videos back where we were out doing a Ned rig and we were just kind of popping the Ned rig off the bottom. I want to take some of my little swim baits that I make, and a little two and a half inch boot tail swim bait. And I wanted to try it with that because I felt like the action would be a little bit better because of the tail. So I just rigged this up on a uh, little Z-Man jig head, a, a tenth ounce, using four pound test line. And that's it there, just a very simple setup. And, you know, once again, just kind of by way of reminder, because this was working for us uh, a few days ago, you know, it's just a matter of just throwing this thing out there, letting it hit the bottom, and you just pop that slack a couple of times. Just like that. And what it does is it lifts that bait up, gives it a couple of jerks, and then it um, 
it just falls head first back to the bottom, which means that boot tail is uh, is moving well. I'm probably only uh, lifting this bait maybe a foot or maybe a foot off the bottom, if that much. I'm really not lifting that much. It's just that little hit that slack. It's going to jump. It's a reaction bite. If I get it around them, believe me, they can't help it. They're going to bite it every time. Uh, sometimes they move on me and I got to go find them again. But if I get it around them, uh, I guarantee you they're going to bite this thing over and over again. Oh, whoop. Let me see if I can get him. He bit. Let's see if he comes back for it. Sometimes I'll swim it and they'll come back for it. I missed that guy. But anyway, it's a simple technique. I like a light action rod. This is a Daiwa rod and a Daiwa reel. I think I paid like 70 bucks for this whole outfit. It's really my crappie rod, but I'll I'll put this in the description below, uh, the, the name of it. I really like this rod and this reel. And these little swim baits, little light jig heads, light line, catch a bunch of fish. Thanks for tuning in, everybody. I appreciate you all. Thank you.